Hi everybody, and welcome to Survival Dads. So you join me in the woods, dark, alone, and slightly scared. <laughs> but I'm not that scared, because with me, I have my R50 Pro by Olight. It's a bit of a bit of light on it, so I can show you it. So here it is. This is the R50 Pro Seeker. Absolute beast of a torch, or a flashlight, depends on where in the world you're from. Um, so yeah, I've had this torch now for probably coming up to a year, and uh, it's my absolute favourite, and I wanted to kind of show it off to you guys. So what I'll do is um, I'll read off some technical specs, um, so I don't get this wrong, um, but look at that beam of light. <laughs> Um, I'll read off some technical specs uh, so I don't get it wrong and then I'll spin the camera around and I'll actually show you the uh, power and how good this is actually seeking out whatever it is you want to see. So um, yeah, I'll just read those specs off. I do have my phone, um, I am in the woods so forgive me for doing that but I want to make sure that I get you the uh, correct information. Okay, so a uh, few technical specifications for the actual torch itself. It has a beam distance of 820 feet or 250 meters. So this is a real thrower. Superb at actually throwing that beam of light exactly where you need it. This is a torch perfect for people hunting, people look, thinking about uh, home defense, law enforcement, search and rescue, or anyone that really wants to put some light out on their campsite. So it has a maximum lumen output of 3,200 meters, uh, sorry, 3,200 lumens. So there is this brightness here. Really, really bright. It has a magnetic USB charge base. It has a light intensity measured in candela of 156,000. So it is super, super bright. Excuse the uh, ambulance there. Uh, the light form is uh, a standard hotspot diameter with impressive distance, the perfect all-round beam profile. So that is as described by Olight itself. So to use the torch you have a simple uh, button push on the side, and I'll talk through that later. Size-wise, fits in the hand really nicely. It has some weight to it, but it's not cumbersome in that way. Really, really smart. So you have a number of different modes on the actual torch, which I'll now run through. So first of all, you have the lowest light level here. So that is 60 lumens. Hopefully you can pick up some of that in the trees there. Um, so this has a runtime of 50 hours. So at 60 lumens, you're gonna be looking at around 50 hours of illumination. So the next uh, level, will be uh, this one, there we go. We're now looking at 400 lumens. This will run for seven hours and 30 minutes. So nice and bright, 400 lumens is a decent brightness for a torch and this will run it for over seven hours. Moving up again, so holding down the uh, push button, we take ourselves up to uh, 1,500 lumens and this will run for 2 hours and 40 minutes at this brightness. Now this is bright, hopefully you can see this in the trees. I'll kind of walk forward and show you a little bit. Hopefully you can see this. So I'm looking at trees which are anything from 25 to about 100 meters away from me. very bright and that's not even at its brightest. So next up we have the highest level which is 3200 lumens. Now this is bright. So to use this, click it on, moment, click it on, double click and there we have it. That is 3200 lumens. It's bright, it throws that light incredibly far it's perfect for rescue, law enforcement, or home defense, home security, things like that. Absolutely amazing. It really is good. 
Um, you're not actually picking it up as well um, as the human eye can. The camera obviously isn't picking up everything like I am. Um, but I'll walk forward and hopefully you can see some of the beam. You can really see that beam there. Incredibly bright, incredibly effective, and it also glows. Hopefully the camera is picking that glow up. Very nice. So if you're interested in checking out the R50 Pro Seeker, be sure to check out Olight UK. I'll put a link in the description below. Check them out. Fantastic customer service, fantastic products, and fantastic prices. Check it out and light up your world. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Stay seen, and I'll see you soon. So one feature that I forgot to mention actually is the strobe function. So a strobe uh, can serve a number of different purposes. Uh, the main one being self-defense. If someone is coming at you in a self-defense situation, uh, you may want to dazzle them to uh, not only disorientate, but also temporarily blind them. Now with the R50 Pro, you simply click three times in quick succession, and you have 3,200 lumens of pure strobe action going towards them. So not only at the moment is it dazzling moths and little flies quite considerably, it's actually, oh, it's insane, it's like, a, it's like a disco. I'll just walk out in front so you can kind of see this. It's terribly disorientating. And a real useful feature to have in a torch.